with so many emerging hotels, cafes, restaurants, and other hospitality concepts, guests are harder to please than ever before. The modern guest has high expectations. With the growth of food and beverage TV shows, the internet, and the social media, the expectations are high. Not only for the product, but the experience as well. In this lesson, I will discuss how to provide a point of difference with a guest experience, how this sets you apart, and how this can lead to a repeat business from your existing and new guests. A business is only a business when it has customers, people who will buy from the business. In a sea of establishments that have similar offerings, the only real difference can be the guest experience. Today, for example, Amazon is the world's largest retailer but not because of the products they offer, but because of the shopping experience they provide. Though the products offered on Amazon can be found in many physical stores or even in other online retailers, many people choose to purchase the same products on Amazon because of the experience they receive from shopping there. User-friendly website, next day delivery, simple returns, seamless processing of orders, and a peace of mind. According to current statistics, 60% of hospitality businesses don't make it past the first year. The guest experience is the difference between average and great establishments, between keeping the establishment open or closed. Online reviews have a huge impact on the guest's buying decision. When we are trying to think about where to go for dinner, which hotel to stay in, we now decide this based on which establishment has the best reviews, more so than their cuisine or location. With online review sites such as Yelp, Google Reviews, and other industry review sites, people are buying based on other people's experience and opinions, even if they're strangers. This is called social proof. People look for social proof to influence their own buying decisions. When people share positive experiences they had in your establishment, they want to repeat and relive that experience. They will relive it in two ways. One, come back to your establishment for more, and two, share their positive experience with others, friends, family, and strangers. When people have negative experiences, they will also share them to vent and to warn others from having a similar negative experience. These negative experiences often turn into negative online reviews as well as offline conversations with their friends, and the message spreads far and wide. When people share bad experiences, they tell at least 12 people face to face. Those 12 will tell another six. Those six tell three more, and that's over 300 people who will hear about that one bad experience. And this number is much bigger when people use social media and review sites. Each social media post can reach thousands of people all at once. Let's also note that negative posts have a better staying power, which means people are more prone to share, read, and reshare posts about negative experiences rather than the positive ones. This is how one negative review can really hurt your establishment and your own bottom line. Guest experience is the most important thing you sell. In today's world, having a great product is no longer the standard. The standard is way higher than that. A great product must come with a great experience. Buying a great product is an even exchange. People already expect to get their money's worth. However, people don't remember or rave about having their expectations met. They rave about extras, people, places, and experiences that blow them away. Great guest experience adds value to the purchase, or an average guest experience takes value away from it. You know this yourself. How many times have you been to a restaurant with average food but really great service, where all your needs are and wants are anticipated, where people know your name and treat you like you matter? This is probably your favorite restaurant that you go back to over and over again because of how you feel when you go there, not necessarily because they have the best food. People purchase based on their emotions, and this can't be ignored. 86% of guests purchase based on how they feel. The value of the product you offer goes up when you provide a great experience along with it. And these experiences are created through your guests' emotions. We must help induce positive emotions in our guests for them to want to come back for more. Guest experience is the most important thing you sell. It can either add value to their purchase 
or you can take value away from it. It's important to take all of this into consideration. What you do to enhance the guest experience will have an impact in either a positive or a negative way. Before your next shift, go through a couple of review sites and read what your guests are saying about your company or the company you work for. Now write a list of actions that you can do to meet the guest needs. Providing a positive guest experience increases your guest count. Guests make buying decisions based on how they feel. The modern guest has high expectations and is prepared to be critical. 